Sometimes we turn it on as fancy, but it is what it is. There's the thing. I've recorded this video three times. The first one it cut, the second one it cut, the third one it didn't cut. I mean the screen record. But now Raru it record the whole thing and then the voice is all meshy and distorted like I put it over. And I'm like, what happened? Because it's not it's not like I covered them the microphone and stuff. But anyways, here's the thing. I'm gonna record this video for the fourth time. Because what I found on the on on the website on this website is very interesting. So here's the thing. <clears throat> for those of you who never never diva, I'm pretty sure about the Zodo in indefinite school. I'm really into cars. Even if I'm just bored instead of going to Twitter or Facebook, I tend to go or auto trader just to broadcast to see what's the trend, the new prices, the new futures, and all those things. So I'm browsing. I wanted, I wanted the the GTI, uh, regardless if whether it's a Polo GTI or a Golf GTI. And I was like, let me just put in 450. But the thing is, I wanted uh, the max of 400,000. But I put in the 50,000 more, just that the filter doesn't kick out. Maybe one of the best or the potential car. So it's, it's, I put the minimum of 300,000 and the maximum of 450. Now I was like, search. And I'm browsing and I'm like, I'm not interested on the previous, the 2018 till 2021 Polo GTI. I wanted the 2017 one. 2017 and 16 is really dope. I really like that car. And I'm browsing and browsing and browsing. And then jiggy jiggy, here's the thing. Very 2013 Golf 5 GTI 2.0 auto edition 35 the moment you still want to edition 35 i was like wait no what so if instead of the person of guru if i want to go to the special edition or the edition it means that but it's self-explanatory the edition it means that the owner or the manufacturer or the producer of the car definitely so that people are really loving the car so if people are really loving the car they tend to produce a limited number of of cars let's say they're gonna produce three thousand three thousand only units for that car and hoping to sell that car more and it's mostly um aimed at uh, collectors people who really love cars because if I have a GTI and I have an edition one, it's more like I'm unique or I'm special. So this one is really, really special, guys. And they're asking for 380000 with the mileage or the kilometers of only 48000 on the clock. So I'm like, no, wait, what's going on? It's either this is, this is a giveaway or there's something wrong with the car. But me being me, I'm like, okay, let me rush down to the description only to, to see Urukwit Emlingi Guru. And here's what the owner says about the, the seller said about the car. They said that it's a 2013 Golf 6 GTI Edition 35 DSG. Only 48,000 kilometers, like I've said, which is really, really good. So, I mean, even if I were to buy a car pre-owned and I want in 48,000 kilometers, I wouldn't mind because imagine, for me, I feel like the... <clears throat> The letting go or my legend of Furia Pair Chicago, Kuri Kutumutuai. So, if I have a hundred thousand, if I set up on Chavo, Kuri, even Chimbir. So, this one being 48,000, I'm like, do the maths. It means I have still have 52,000 kilometers. I can travel the whole of South Africa with this, those miles without getting a problem. It tends to happen sometimes on other cars. Some other cars gonna give you a headache, even if they're still new. But generally speaking, it being 40,000 is a good news. <clears throat> and they continue to say that the car has full service history. So I'm going to make a video on this one explaining my experience on my previous two cars based on the only the top. The topic is going to be service history of the cars because I have a lot to say about this one. And the owner continued to say that the car has spare keys. So it being having spare keys means that the car is really like new, like they are claiming it to be. And they will continue to say it's a one owner. It makes sense. PDC. And then they said that sunroof, sunroof is like one of the best features. Sweat seats. So sweat seats uh, is this one for those maybe that are not. Uh, familiar with it sweat seat is this one as you can see in the middle here there's this thing like it's cloth it's meshy it's soft kind of thingy 
and then there's leather so that's what it's sweatsuit it's very nice because it's soft it's so nice because it's soft and then they said there's a golf ball gear knob so golf thingy knobby knobby is this thing as you can see there's a golf thing here that's what they mean it's special you're not gonna find that on every car or on every golf and then they say that um, a full original car i don't know what i mean there but i think it's an error and then they continue to say that the, it still has new car smell and i was like okay that's do because you're saving in a car perfume with a new car smell you don't and you can't and then they say that it's a collector's piece like i've said and then sunroof they're repeating radio airbag electric windows park distance control full service record climate control alarm zoom lights cruise control blah, blah, blah. some of the things they're repeating and if you're gonna get the car on <clears throat> if you're gonna get the car on what on a loan you can to supply a loan you're gonna pay monthly installments up until you finish and if you're gonna pay the the deposit of 337,990 and then with interest rate of 12% repayments period of the month of 72 months this is what you're going to pay you're going to pay monthly payment of 6684 and then the total payment will be 481,277 with the total interest of 1 Hundred and thirty-nine thousand three hundred and sixty-seven. I feel like it's dope. I I will pay them this kind of money, and then I get my dream car. For me, this can really be my car. My car, like honestly speaking, it can be my car. And I I just assume that for for insurance, you're going to pay somewhere around oh, my one point eight to my two point something based on your risk profile. For someone like me, which uh, whose license is still new, I'm still young and less than younger than thirty, less than thirty. The insurance gonna they're gonna want more to 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 insure me. I mean that's how they roll. If you're young, you are a high high risk client, so whatever those kind of thing. But anyways, let me know if you had three hundred and eighty. Let's say 85 because the 380 is not going to cover everything. You still have to pay the money for uh, licensing and registration, which can cost you roughly 2,000, 3,000 rands and, and so. So if you had, man, look at the six. Wow. Will you get this car or not? And if not, which one will you get for 400,000? Let's say 380,000. Which one will you go for? But as for me, honestly speaking, if today I, you give me 380,000 rands, tomorrow I'm flying, I'm driving, taking a bus to, to Centurion to get this car. Like, to get this car. And if you don't mind, you might as well share the video to someone that you think they're really into car so that we get their um, opinion on this one. And who knows, maybe someone is looking for a car like this and it might help. But till then... Peace.